we have had 800,000 nuisance call in 2021. That's a lot, right? I'm DSP Kiran, OC Incident Watch in Police Operation Command Centre. I manage the seven uh, senior watch officers and watch officers across the seven land division uh, during the 12-hour operation duty, managing incident to cases like robbery, stabbing, to cases uh, where we get query from hospitals or land division. Technology is actually the bedrock of POCC. The police camera which is all connected uh, to the Police Operation Command Centre coupled with the video analytic capabilities that we have enable us to actually uh, track cases as it is happening and provide images to the ground responding forces that are dispatched to the cases. The capability also allows us to play back hours after incident has happened, which actually aid in the investigation and apprehending uh, offenders that could have uh, committed the crime. We receive about uh, approximately 3,200 calls in the 12-hour shift. We had a case of stabbing. We had a call uh, by two callers, two independent callers, saying that uh, they had sighted uh, a person armed with a weapon at one of our parks in Singapore. When our ground response forces, when they arrived, no one was there with any weapon. But the callers were very confident they had seen a person with weapon, so we tried to play back our police cameras. That actually gave us an image, and after linking all the dots with the sense making at the at the police official command center, we managed to link it to a case which actually occurred the previous night. And with that information and the currency of the information that was given to us during that sh during our ongoing shift, we managed to solve that case within four hours. Since 2018, uh, all the seven land division are actually placed on a single watch floor where we actually work very closely with one another. Our call takers uh, actually are trained to uh, listen to the callers because uh, most of the time callers who are suicidal tend to display certain distress. So what we will do is we will try to listen to them, calm them down, um, let them know that we are here to help and uh, through that reassurance we actually try to get more information as to where they are how do they intend to uh, commit suicide so that uh, aid can be actually given to them as fast as possible all calls that comes through the police emergency lines are treated seriously uh, however, if a nuisance call is picked up, it actually hampers a genuine uh, urgent call where police Stop assistance fighting. can be rendered. Well, if a call is a blank call, our call takers will actually um, say about three times hello, hello, hello to ensure that no call is missed out. But if it's clearly a blank call, we will hang it up. I also would like this opportunity to clear the misconception that if a caller is rude to our call taker, we will hang up. Actually, no. As I have said before, all calls to the police emergency line are treated as serious. So what we will do is at our end, we will advise them to calm down um, and continue to give us the information. The most important thing is to act upon the information that they are giving us. So that was a question with OC Incident Watch Group from Police Operation Command Centre.